the FIA Formula 3 European Championship races 19, 20 and 21 take place at Belgium's legendary 7 kilometer long Arden roller coaster. The pole sitter is the championship leader Lance Stroll, the fastest driver for the first race. But due to the heavy rain, the race would get underway behind the safety car. Clearly then Lance Stroll would keep ahead, followed by P2 on the grid. That's Maximilian Gunter, also for Bremer Power Team. And then it was Ben Barnacote going from P3 for the high-tech Grand Prix team. When the cars were eventually released, George Russell from the high-tech Grand Prix team would overtake Harrison Newey for Van Amersford Racing to take P5. So lots of spray and still conditions very difficult indeed as Weiwon Tan found out as he had spun and hit the tyre stacks with the rear of his car. Let's look at that in replay. Out on his own, the back end of the car steps out. Car pirouettes and Weiwon Tan is in the uh, safety barriers. Safety car was deployed and the final lap then and it would be 17-year-old Lance Stroll from Prima Power Team that would win the 19th race of the FIA Formula 3 European Championship season, followed by Maximilian Gunter and Ben Barnacote taking P2 and P3. Ben Barnacote, incidentally, the best-placed rookie driver. So they're the result in full here from Race 1 spa Francorchamps. With his seventh season win, Stroll then extends his lead in the driver's standings. The Canadian now has 63 points more than his nearest rival, which is Maximilian Gunter. So the grid for race two, then George Russell pole position, Joel Eriksson P2, then it's Nikita Mazepan and Mikkel Jensen going on the next row of the grid. So George Russell then uh, keeps the lead, followed by uh, Joel Eriksson for Moto Park and Nikita Mazepan. So into the source go the FIA Formula 3 European Championship cars and it's a spin for Ralph Aron, the Prima Power Team driver. We'll manage to get the car round and uh, back from there. Now Mikkel Jensen started from P4 with a good start and here we can see uh, Mikkel Jensen, Callum Eilert and then the Prima Power Team car of Maximilian Gunter as they go through the bus stop chicane heading towards the start-finish line and at the end of the opening lap, the Dane benefiting from the fact that the car driven by Nikita Mazepan came to a halt due to a technical problem. Jensen brought the third place he'd inherited home in a safe way. George Russell drives an undisputed Leitster flag victory. The best-placed rookie, Joel Eriksson for Moto Park and Mikkel Jensen for Cave Styler 24 Mooka Motorsport accompanied the 18-year-old Brit who'd started from pole position onto the podium. P4 was Anton Hubert, uh, Callum Eilert took P5 and uh, Pedro Piquet was P6. Final points paying position for P10 goes the way of Nico Carey. So George Russell then scoring his second win of the season in the FIA Formula 3 European Championship for High Tech GP. Well done George Russell and he's in pole position for the starting grid for race number three with Joel Eriksson P2, Ben Barnico P3 and Callum Eilert P4. Well, as the cars get underway, you can see that it's a torrid start for George Russell, the pole sitter, and he loses many places. And Joel Eriksson, it is, that takes over the lead. Antoine Hubert for Van Amersfoort Racing with a good start from P5, now finds himself in P2. And it is the points championship leader, Lance Stroll, that runs in P3. George Russell, though, does make up for his uh, bad start and now targets the uh, P3 placed Lance Stroll going into the uh, bus stop chicane ahead of the start finish line and uh, a perfect overtake move there from uh, George Russell overtaking Lance Stroll for P3. On the final lap it will be Joel Eriksson that will win the race and he's delighted with that. Antoine Hubert would be P2 and uh, George Russell then taking the final podium place for P3. So Lance Stroll then leading the championship, followed by Maximilian Gunter and George Russell. The next event in the FIA Formula 3 European Championship at the Nürburgring for Round 8, races 22 to 24 of the 2016 season.